sentences. So, kyouwa tanashiku nakatta desu yo. Okay, tanen desu ne. Kyouwa atsui demo samui demo nai desu. Okay, nice job. Kyouwa isugashi desu. Kyouwa tsumaranai desu. Kyouwa mushashi desu. Pinky. Make sure you don't let it stick through up there because it changes it into something very different. Go no pinky wa chotto samui desu. There you go. Okay. Also, when you're writing the ki in pinky, it's one, two, three, four, five, six. So that bent line is all one piece. So you don't want it to stick out because then it looks like two lines. Make sense? Mm -hmm. okay. Any questions? Okay. Conjugatable stuff, let's conjugate. Everything else we'll just kind of run through it in order. Tabeiru. Okay, means picky. And then, tabemas, tabemasen, tabemashita, tabemasen deshita. Iku, go, ikimas, ikimasen, ikimashita, ikimasen deshita. Nomu, to drink, nomimas, nomimasen, nomimashita, nomimasen deshita. Miru, watch, mimas, mimasen, mimashita, mimasen deshita. Yaru, to do, yarimasen, yarimashita, yarimasen deshita. Kiku, to ask, kikimas, kikimasen, kikimashita, kikimasen deshita. Noru, to ride, norimas, norimasen, norimashita, norimasen deshita. Dekakeru, to go out. できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。できます。でき
Are you kind of in the middle? Okay. Anyone else kind of in the middle? Sort of? No, I'm, no. I'm, I'm good. I'm going to have an intimate moment with my book this uh, <laughs> weekend. So okay. That sounded wrong. <laughs> All right. Okay. okay. Do, do you guys want to? We've got the time. So should we go ahead and do it since we've got the sure. time? Sure. Yes. Yes. Let's okay, go. let's do it. So, Otoko no hito, man. 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 Yes, 
Yasumi. Vacation. Yasumi. Vacation. Yasumi. Vacation. Vacation. Yasumi. Break. Yasumi. Absence. Yasumi. My. Sheets. My. Sheets. My. Sheets. Sheets. My. Sheets. My.
Skina. I feel like maybe we would benefit from like where we're at now, going through them like like the definition one and then maybe doing the one where we do it less times but isolate the ones we're hesitating on. Okay, so like as I'm going through them, put yeah. them into the two stacks based yeah. on which ones you're not getting easily and then maybe go through the didn't get it so well stack yeah. a second time or something. Okay, that sounds like a good idea. We can try that next class. I didn't sort them that way this time, but I can in the future. Okay, yeah, and if I'm not saying it, if only you are, then I'll be able to judge that better about whether people are hesitating over it or not. Because when I say it with you, then it's easy for you guys to just say it too. Okay, so uh, let's look at, okay, so we're starting with part D, I think, Kyakuyonju Peji. Okay, did we start that exercise but not finish it, or did we not start it yet? We, we I think barely started, started it, it, so it might as well. I think well, we, we did the examples in one of them, and then you said, have some ready tomorrow. Okay, okay, so who wants to start? Okay, so uh, are we just going to... You can yas be... Yasumi, me, uh, yeah. Eida, o, uh, oh, no, me, uh, so saw it in the past, so... Uh, I'm drawing a blank, I apologize. Uh, Miru, Mimas. Mimas, 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 and Desha. So Mimas, three times it's in the past. Hi. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, Yasumi, Mi, Ega, Mi, or Ega, O, um, Mimas. Hi. And then you can ask how it was. So desu ka? Do desu ka? Just scary. And that was Ko. Uh, I apologize. Kowai and Kowai Katta Des. Kowai Katta Des. You're right. Kowai, Kowai Des, Kowai Des. Kowai Katta Des. Kowai Katta Des. There you go. Kowai Katta Des. Hi. Ja, Sanban. Kino. Niban, sorry. Kino, Uchi ni Imashita. Hi. Oh, I'm sorry. So, this card. どうですかどうでしたかどうでしたかはいつまらないつまらなかったですはいつまらなかったですはいはいはいはい。and you could add the totemo because it says very boring so とてもつまらなかったですはいとてもつまらなかったですねはいどうぞ週末はパーティーに行きました どうですかどうでしたかはい。どうでしたかはい。楽しくなかったです。はい。楽しくなかったですね。はい。じゃあ次。あ、ドリ。ドリ。ドリ。ドリ。ドリ。ドリ。ドリ。ドリ。ドリ
Would that be like now? And that was just what it said on the CD. But that, would that be calling the television boring, or would that be understood as what is shown um, on the television boring? Honestly, if they had given you the word bangumi, which means program, 
Okay. That would make more sense. Yeah. Well, tomorrow night, Bangui. So like uh, Terebi no, or Shimara Nai, Terebi no Bangui. Yeah. Yeah, that would make more sense to me, but yeah. they haven't taught the phrase yet. They okay. haven't taught the term Bangumi, so they, um, they're just kind of making do with Terebi by itself. But honestly, it seems a little weird to me to just call it boring TV instead of a boring TV program. Mm. You know, because, I mean, the box itself isn't what's boring. Right? Yeah. It feels like it makes sense to do a like branching thing like here's TV, here's like things you have to talk about with TV. So. Right, yeah, it seems like that would have made sense. Just even if they just introduced the one term bangumi, that would have helped. I don't know why they didn't, yeah. but they didn't. Between that and movie, you could have covered the yeah. much all TV. Right. So anyway, moving on. What was all? Um Mayari Sanwa Isabashi Hito Desna. Hi, so this Hima. Can you guess? What makes it a na adjective? The na on the end, right? And what? And why would they even put the na on the end? Because you change the verb at the end. Or but I mean, you drop the na for all the conjugations we've done thus far, right? Yes. So. Why even put a na in there in the first place? Because it gets used here. So is that like it's part so, of the form when you connect it to the noun? Pretty yeah, the, okay. the na is like the glue that sticks it to the noun. It okay. attaches to the noun that way. So. Hi, himana todas. A person with free time. Yeah, she's a free person. Sounds weird when you translate it that way. I think she's just sad. Oh, I, really yeah. I think she's under a lot of stress at her new job. Oh, how I saw. Okay. Oh, yeah, Takeshi's the one who always gets the, the worst stuff, right? Okay, Brando san, Rokuban. Hi, Niyakanamachi desne. Nanaban. Clean, beautiful, sparkling room. So, Kide, what goes in the middle there? What we were just talking about. What what makes it different from any adjective? Hi, Kidena. Hey, Hi. Would you call like a garden? Would you call it clean, or would you call it like healthy? Uh, a garden. Like if you had like. Huh? It, well, Kide also means beautiful. So okay. If, if okay. something that, is yeah, pretty, you would use Kide. Could you use uh, Genki Na? I mean, if it was like green and everything. Okay. Not really, because Genki, although they translate it as both healthy and energetic. It kind of in, includes both concepts into one thing. Okay. If if you're talking about something just being healthy, as in good for your health, like eating your veggies or something, mm -hmm. there's a different word for that. Okay. If you're talking about something that, like a person who is both energetic and healthy, presumably if they're like bouncing around, have a lot of energy. They also are healthy, otherwise they wouldn't be so bouncy and energetic, right? So Genki kind of implies both of those. Okay. Somebody who's healthy and energetic, and Genki does normally apply to people and animals, not um, other things. Okay. It's usually animate objects. Uh, there's a great little scene in Tonami no Totoro where the, the little girl, the four-year-old, is running around like a maniac and bumps smack into the grandmother. And the grandmother turns around and looks at her and says, Genki da ne? You know, you're so energetic, you know? Yeah, so, yeah, Genki is often used to describe little kids because they're generally bouncing off the walls anyway. <laughs> so. 
So if you have like a bitty yappy dog for it to be like... Be yeah, like, like a nice. high energy bouncy little Yorkie that's like hopping up and down off the furniture all the time, Yankee. Definitely. Is there a different word for energetic if someone was uh, like art via means of like drugs? Or um, caffeine or something? Yeah. <laughs> um, there probably is a different word for that, but I can't think of it right now. Okay. <laughs> so I'll let you know if I come up with something. All right. <laughs> yeah. So if, if, yeah, if somebody's just had too, too many cups of coffee that day and they're sort of jittery and hyper, that's probably a different term, but I can't think of it at the moment. Okay. Moving on. Jock. Punk B. Okay, so let's see. There are so and so Marian san to Ken san example of Yundi Kasai. B, right? Hi. So you're the Q, he's the A. Marian san wa Donna Ito Deska. Deska. Yari san wa Yasash. David. <laughs> Yasashi to desk. Hi, so it's net. Ja. So. Susan to. So. Susan wa donna hito desu ka? Susan wa kirei na hito desu. Hi. Roberto san wa donna hito desu ka? Hi. Oh, I'm sorry, I was Roberto san wa donna hito desu ka? Um, let's see. Hi, so it's net. Jackson, Takeshi san wa donna hito desu ka? Takeshi san wa genki na hito desu. Hi, genki na hito desu ne. Hi, genki na hito. Okay, sakana ga suki desu ka? Okay, now we're getting into talking about likes and dislikes. Woo woo! <laughs> Okay, so we can use ski, dai ski, kirai, dai kirai, but also don't forget about ski janai, ski janai desu, also amari ski janai desu, zenzen ski janai desu, those are all good options. And you can also do it the other way around. Um, instead of kirai, you, you can do kirai janai desu. I don't hate it. When it's not your favorite thing, but you'll tolerate it, kirai janai desu. You know, amari kirai janai desu doesn't get used that often though. Would totemo work too? Or? Totemo ski desu. Can work, but dai ski desu is more likely since you've got that option. <laughs> okay, and then Ski demo kirai demo nai desu is I neither, I neither like, like nor dislike it. So if you're really indifferent, you don't have a strong opinion either way. Ski demo kirai demo nai desu. Hi. Should be nearly that long. <laughs> I was reading it while well doing my homework earlier. I went. The explanation. Uh, it is. It would be faster to say if you neither like it nor dislike it. Yeah. Than to say. You just have to get faster at speaking Japanese. We just need Japanese. to learn all the kanji. <laughs> all the kanji once we get back there. Kirai demo kirai demo Well, kirai has a kanji that takes up the kira. But um, the rest of it mostly stays in hiragana, honestly. Okay, I got Your life was ruined. I got it was demolished. It doesn't really shorten it much. Why are you going to crush my dream, Sensei? Um, <laughs> like, like, I've never had um, natto. Ah. How do you say I don't know? Shirimasen. Shiri. I don't know. Shiri. Like Shiri. Oh, I don't. Oh, Shiri. No, Shirimasen. Oh, Shiri. Not to be confused with Oshiri. What is that? Shiri, which is the anatomy you're sitting on. Oh. <laughs> 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 Completely how, different. How do you do that? You like mess up a sound and they're like, oh, no, that means no, what? No, 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 you don't know. Uh, my mom has this joke that when my grandmother came here with her, my mom was like, let's go out to get seafood. But the problem is, in Viet, seafood means your butt. 
Uh oh. That's fun. So her mom thought she was saying, let's go out. Get some booty. Oh, yeah. God. Gonna go surf with them in. And she had to explain it all. I was like, no, no. Oh, God. That's, great. That's awful. <laughs> okay, so um, who are we up to here? I don't know. It was okay. me. Okay, so you're going to do A, and Jared's going to do all the permutations of B for us <laughs> for the example. Sakanaga suki deska. So are these four separate things? Yeah, four separate things. So you can say height ski des or height dai ski des. You see what I'm saying? Oh, okay. So I see these are separate. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, uh, but the height can go with either one on the top line, and the EA can go with either one on actually, the bottom line. Yeah, you gotta have like a it love question. And, and Is the ga like used for all not adjectives or just these preference ones? Oh, yeah, ah. thank you. Yeah. Okay, so good question. So, oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see. I was trying to think of a kanji you guys already know. Okay, so just to do it in kanji just because. Watashi wa hon ga daisuki desu. This is the dai in daisuki. It's an easy kanji, I don't know why they don't teach that. Okay. So, so the basic structure is person doing the liking or disliking with wa, then the thing that is liked or disliked, and then ga, and then the like or dislike so not adjective that you want to use. Does that fall under the putting emphasis on it uh, rule? This rule is the standard structure for oh, okay. using ski kirai and also certain other not adjectives that we haven't introduced yet for talking about things that someone is good at or bad at. And it's also the structure that gets used for talking about um, personal attributes, like person wa me eyes ga oki desu. So the person has large eyes. In English, we might say she has large eyes or her eyes are large. In Japanese, they use the wa ga construction for those kinds of phrases. Okay, so this wa ga structure is something that you guys need to just sort of memorize and get used to. It's it does not take o. The ski kirai stuff never takes o. It always takes ga. Okay, so don't know why that's just the way it is. <laughs> Okay, so, so, sakana ga suki desu ka? So you can say, uh, hai suki desu. Or, uh, hai, dai suki desu. Dai suki desu. Uh, ie, um, kirai desu. Or, uh, ie, dai kirai desu. Hai. So those are all the different permutations that you can use. That they're showing you. Plus, you could also say, "Ie amari ski janai desu," or "Ie ski janai desu," "Ie zenzen ski janai desu." Okay. So I, is the guy kind of like you can cook like like and then really like and then yeah don't like and really don't like. Right. Yeah, that's one way to look at it. The dai means big, so it's like. A, a big like or a big dislike. <laughs> what, what was uh, Amari? What was that uh, again? Amari is not too much. Not too oh, much. Shut up. Yeah, that was yeah. back. Uh, Amari and Zen Zen. Uh, those were a long time ago. Or, yeah, those yeah, were yeah, way back in last semester. Yeah, I never mastered those. Yeah, so, so yeah Amari and Zen Zen. Back in lesson negative. 30. Oh man, I nailed it. <laughs> Yay. Okay. So. We're gonna just kind of go around the room. Everybody pick 
Wh whatever the next thing is, you're gonna ask the question about that. So we're gonna go around a, a, for a while okay. to get all of these. Okay, so to start things off, you're gonna ask Marianne if she likes meat. Mm -hmm. Okay? Uh, so first you have to remember the vocabulary word for meat. Who remembers it? I do. <laughs> Or you can even just say, hi, ski desk. Okay, you can do it either way. Okay, those are, you're going to ask if he likes nakutobo. What are, is that like refried? What is that? Fermented it's beans. It's really weird looking because yeah. it looks like there's worms and cheese no. all over it. Yeah. Worms and cheese. Ima okay, so imagine a clump of beans stuck together, and when you try and pull apart, it like pulls apart like the cheese on a worm. Okay. Yeah. 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 <laughs> no. yeah. And Does it smell taste like refried beans? No, no it's no. no. They're fermented soybeans, so it's a very odd taste. I don't like okay. It. So. I don't particularly care for them. <laughs> it's like the poi of Japan. Yeah. Yeah. How do you say most like? Every culture has something that's sort of stinky, and a lot of people don't like the taste of it. Fish. I don't like the What's fish. that? The fish. Um, Here. liverwurst maybe? <laughs> I know cheese. Blue cheese. Yeah. yeah. A lot of people For like some cheese. people, yeah. Like blue cheese. Yeah. Just think fermented. You know. Is there a way to say like probably not? Tabun. Tabun? Would be, would it be like probably. Tabun ski janai. So, did you ask a question yet, though? I didn't hear the question. Oh, sorry. Ski desu ka? So, tabun ski janai desu. Hi, ski desu ne? BA, tabun ski janai desu. And then, are we going across Just the keep, ice cream? Yeah, keep going, yes. So, ice cream ga, or, yeah, yeah. ga, Ski desu ka? Hai, dai ski desu. Hai, desu ne. Ja, soka, saka. Sa, sak. It messes with you. Yeah. Saka, sa, saka, ka, ski desu ka? That is kind of a tongue twister, isn't it? Let's see. Was it kirai janai desu? Hai, kirai janai desu. Okay, you don't hate it. So you could say Shirimasen, I don't know. Or you could use Tabun, maybe Tabun Ski des or you know Ski Jamu Kirai de Monides. What was I don't know? Shirimasen. We haven't covered that okay. yet. Okay. Would it just be shirimasen or is shirimasen? Shirimasen, because it's a verb. Yeah, that's the negative. Shirimasen. The, 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 yeah. I just think yeah. that. Yeah. <laughs> shirimasen. 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 Hi. Ja. Dozo. Golf. Ga. Ski like dictionary version of I know or no or shiru sh or, oh okay, yeah, would right. be the dictionary shiru. form shirimasu yeah, shirimasu shiru okay. sorry Gorufu. okay so we're up to rock music so roku roku no ongaku ga suki desu ka By the way, you don't have to say roku no ongaku just because roku has to be ongaku in Japanese because they've got a different word for rocks. <laughs> okay. So, uh, 
Just it could be like music oh. from you getting rocks together. <laughs> that would be pretty good. Yeah. So Sounds delightful. Like <laughs> Roku. But yeah, Roku means rock and roll music in Japanese. How do you say spoons? Like playing the spoons? <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I'm serious. What is that? Is that I, right? I don't know. Okay, I would have to look that one up. <laughs> I think I thought it was the wrong thing at first. <laughs> okay. Okay, so you're you're up to Jazu. Hi. Okay, never listened to it before? <laughs> okay. Those all. Kura? Yeah, Kurashiku. Kurashiku. Ga, you just cut. Hi, Daisuke desu. Hi, you just met. Job, schoolwork. <laughs> Oh, I'm asking. Yeah, hi, you're asking. I'm hi. just like, who's going to read? <laughs> um, so, testo ga ski desu ka? Ie ski janai desu. Hi. Nihongo no kurasu ga ski desu ka? Eh, ski desu. Hi. Jaa, Shukurai ga ski desu ka? Ie. Oh yeah, we did. He said, he said ski desu, oh, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah I, I, okay. said, I said it. I was like, hi, ski desu. Oh, no. oh, yeah. He was, was very quick, quick and easy. quiet. That was it. I I just just it. it. Well, he didn't make a big deal out of it. Because <laughs> it was just like the easiest one to answer. Right. But, I mean, that's how I felt. So. Right. Yeah. Okay, so. Ocha ski desu ka? Oh, ski desu. <laughs> you remember how to say coffee in Japanese? It's the word. Yeah. Coffee ga ski desu ga. Hi, Coffee ga daisuki desu. Hi, daisuki desu. Mainichi no mi ga. Coffee. But like, is there a word for like need, as in the I need it to function? Yes, there there are several ways you could express that, but. <laughs> Okay, so moving on to part B, these are the open-ended kinds of questions. Donna is asking what? What type? Oh, what, what type? type? So uh, B, I'm um, going to have um, Ken ask, oh, no, wait a minute, Marianne gets to ask the first one because she just answered about Kobe, right? So, you ask that question each one, and Ken's gonna answer. Donna, support. 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 So, could I say, Mizu, or Mizu no sports, like water sports? Oh, okay. Mizu no sports. But is that how you would say water sports? Yeah, you could do that. Sports ga ski des. Hi, So not just one sport in the water, but in just, general yeah. any sport that's in the water. That works. Sports mizu no sports ga ski des. Okay. So donna tabemono ga ski des ka. America no tabemono ga ski des. Hi. That works. Donna nomimono ga ski des ka. Um. Mizu ga ski des. Hi. Did you just say like Mizu desu? Uh, 
Yeah, but Mizugaski does is better for for right. now because I, I want you to practice yeah. using. So like in general, if you were like conversing with someone, would you just be like Mizugaski? Don't know Mizugaski. Don't know. You can, but Mizugaski does. Is, okay. It sounds a little better, just, you know, in general, people usually repeat back the, the word, predicate or, part, okay. the verb or the na adjective plus des or the okay. e adjective plus des. Yeah. It's a little more formal sounding, a little more proper sounding to use the ski des. Okay, ja, tsugi, yonba. Oh, <laughs> I keep spacing out today. I'm sorry. Um, donna e ga dasuki desu ka? Nihon no e ga ja suki desu. Hai, ii desu ne. Ja, goban. Is there a word for B movie? <laughs> like, would you call it like, uh, like yes, what was it, yasai movie? Or uh, yasui movie or something? Yasui no ego? Like, yes, you wouldn't use a no in there because Yasui ego. Oh, yeah, that's an adjective of itself. Yeah. So Yasui ego, would that be? Ega. A, or ega, excuse me. Would that Keep be? Yeah. Cheap movies. Would that be, <laughs> now, would that be like B movie? Or? Yasui ego, Yasui. Maybe. Okay. I've never heard it used that way. Okay. But it's possible. I'm not sure. That's a good question to ask a native speaker. Right. <laughs> Track one. <laughs> if you haven't tried the Hello Talk app yet, ask the um, I have. level three and four people. It just like she was sending me messages at like two a.m. and then she, oh. I felt like I was ruining her bedtime because she's like, I want to learn English. And it's kind, I was it's like, kind of hard. Oh, and I'm like, do you work? And she's like, Yeah, I work in six hours. And I'm like, Have you slept? And she's like, No, I'll be fine. And I'm like, oh, I'm gonna go can, to bed. Can you find somebody you can make an agreement with? won't answer them immediately, that you'll just yeah. answer them when you wake up? Yeah, maybe, maybe. That was the only person who responded to my, like, and uh, I only, yeah. Yeah. I'll get on it. Yeah, because of the time difference, you kind of have to have an agreement with people that this is not going to be an answer immediately kind of texting relationship, it's going to be an answer when I have time yeah. texting relationship, because otherwise you won't get any sleep and neither will they. <laughs> Tenisu o suru, tenisu o shimashou. Hi. So you're just going to take whatever verb phrase they're giving you and change it into a let's do construction. Hi. Tessani san, ichiban no ni shimas. Isho ni kaeru, and then isho ni kaerimashou. Kaerimashou. Hi. Isho ni kaerimashou. So let's go home together. Okay. So probably said to like your roommate or family member or if you're inviting someone over to your house for the afternoon or something you might do it or like if you're neighbors and you want to walk home together or something He said ego o mimashou. Oh, I was so looking at yonban. the numerals. Yeah, yeah. Roman okay. numeral five, yeah. but okay. yonban within that. So you're changing yeah, it. 
Yeah, changing it to the mashol ending. So take the verb, whatever the mas form would be, instead of masu, you do mashol. Did I miss this? Uh, we talked about it one of the days. Uh, you may not have been here that day. I don't remember. So, omiyage, wakarimasu ka? Omiyage. Am I asking a question? You're, you're yeah. just making this statement. It's like, let's do blank. So just the one word by itself is a, a false statement in that case. This phrase would be a false statement. Omiyage o kaimasho. That's what you're going for. Kau is to buy. Is this a new vocabulary oh, word for you guys? I thought this no, was I a thought we covered it. We know those words. Yeah, I thought I, so. I didn't notice the O in there. Sorry. Okay. okay. Uh, omiyage o kaimasho. Kaimasho. はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、は
ましょう。はい。So whatever suggestion the person makes with ましょうか、it's like shall we? Okay, and then so しましょう is like yes, let's do that. What you just suggested. Okay. じゃあジャレットさん、why don't you try it? Ichiban. They're giving you the first part, but then you have to come up with a suggestion that you think makes sense in relation to that first sentence. So, for example, atsui desu ne, it means. That's what I'm trying to remember. Atsui, atsui, atsui. Hot. Okay, so if it's hot, maybe you want to go swimming, for example. Number seven in the previous exercise. No, I'm, I'm, try, I'm trying to come up with the. Sorry, my brain's not working. Okay. So if you want to do atsui desu ne, it's hot, isn't it? And then do you want to suggest swimming, surfing? Well, what? I was going to say surfing, but it's. s a r f i n g this and I'm not seeing where, where it. How you would put it together? Surfing o shimashou. Surfing takes suru. Just like tennis o shimashou. Surfing o shimashou. Okay? Katakana sports generally always take suru. Does that help? On the example,、um, okay. where's the no me shimash? Okay, so the example they're doing, samui desu ne, it's cold, isn't it? O cha o no me masho ka, shall we drink tea? Okay, they're, if you're doing safin o shimasho ka, that fits that same pattern, right? Okay, I see. Okay, I see what it's doing. Okay. So, s e s o Okay, and then you're gonna say Niban. What? Okay, that's probably not good. What, what was so s h i m a s h o So s h i m a s h o is let's do that. Yes, let's do that.、Okay. You're just agreeing with the suggestion. Oh, because it's like so.、Uh, it's the so, like、right、from so desu. Yeah, yeah.、Okay. So s h i m a s h o Let's do what you just said. Okay. <laughs> So, Juniji d e s n e which means、uh, 1 30. No, Juni. Juni. 12. Yeah, it's 12 o'clock, isn't it? As in noon. So, what might be a suggestion at noon? So you just have to agree. So, uh, so, しし so, しし okay, we, we are out of time, but、I、does、start. that make sense? Yes. Okay, no, no, no. so next class, we can start from there. We can finish that exercise. What is the exam? Um, I think the week from Tuesday. I want to say.
say a week from today. Uh, yeah, it's next Thursday. Yeah, yeah I believe it's on a Thursday. So, so, um, so next class on Tuesday, we will hopefully finish the Matane as well and spend some time talking about the kanji activities. So please, over the weekend, also try to get caught up on doing kanji practice stuff and particularly pay attention to reading these handwritten hagaki because the handwritten style is different to read than the print fonts you've been used to. So you might find those more challenging and time consuming to read than you're expecting depending on how you feel about those two different handwriting styles because they look like they were written by two different people also. I have a question. Hi. Does Miru work for like something you saw in passing, or more like, like oh, I saw a cat, or what, is there a different verb specifically for like spotting something, or do you think? Um, no, it's pretty much the same verb. Terubi mo mimashita neko ga neko mimashita. You know, I saw a cat. I watched a TV show. You know. Watching like a match. Tennis or Mimash. Yeah, so yeah, when when you're talking about sports that you like, you can talk about watching them or um, playing them. And we're we're not gonna get to it now. Oh so uh, there's a structure that we will learn eventually where you can actually put a verb into a, a noun phrase and say that I like watching sports or I like playing sports because they're two different things, right? You know, just to say I like tennis, well, that doesn't clarify whether you like playing it or like watching it or both, right? Mm -hmm. So, Sensei, what does the the reading and writing section in your textbook, you know how they're they're divided into the two sections? Also, that's also, could you when you look at the, in the very back of your book, it's actually called Yomi Kakihen. And that's the start yeah, that's of this thing. section so where it starts the hiragana, the katakana, and the kanji. Mm -hmm. So young, I, I labeled it Yomi Kakihen, and then you, know, you you should be able to find chapter five for yourself because you know I mean you've already done up to here presumably right lesson four stuff right yeah I'm just curious what is there one and two Roman numeral or no not Roman numeral one A B C two A B yeah, they, they do it by Roman numerals and letters, just like in, you know, so two, A, B, and C, and then three has a section. So that most of the Yomi Kakihen segments have like Roman numeral one, two, and three. Most of them don't have more than that, but the, usually Roman numeral one is all the sort of Free reading practice, reviewing how to use the kanji that they're working with. And then usually Roman numeral two is the reading passages, which are going to be longer and longer as we go on. So now they're like a couple of paragraphs, two or three at a time. By the end of this textbook, you're reading like whole little short stories that take up two pages. So you can make sure you can and everybody teaches English. Reading and writing section. Okay. Oh yeah. So the RBI is next Thursday or is it uh, next Tuesday? Because I see two OPI, but I don't. Thank you, Sensei. Okay. Uh, okay. Let me read what I've got. Okay. So. Okay, OPI no Renshu is what you're seeing for Thursday. And actually, Gokan no Shiken is actually Tuesday of the following week. So today is what? Today is the 21st, right? So
So next week, the 26th and 28th, we actually still have two classes left. Your test is actually not until February 2nd. Okay, do you see where it says Gokan no Shiken? Shiken means test. Does that help? Um, week four, the week Tuesday. Five, uh, Shiken. Okay, Shiken. Gokan no Shiken is. Lesson five, test. Okay. I'm surprised they didn't do tests though. Uh -huh. I didn't even think of that because <laughs> that is a, this chapter's vocab, but Shiken mm -hmm. is a more advanced vocab that I just I was in the mode of using that consistently for everything. So, but yeah, I could have done tests though for you guys. That would have been a good use of your recent vocab. Oh well, missed an opportunity. So next to here, it says OPI one no, uh, what is that kanji? OPI no renshu oh, yes, is renshu. for next week. So meaning we were going to practice mm -hmm. for the OPI. Right. And then OPI to yomikaki shiken means the OPI and the reading and writing test. It's weird okay. the kanji for that part like totally dropped off on my copy. Oh. So it, I just got the hiragana in between, it looks like. Okay, so oh. we still got another week until the test. That's really weird. How Maybe did that it was happen? just a weird thing in transferring into Google Docs. That could be, because you got you've got a lot of weirdness yeah. on yours. I mean I get it, but Yeah, it's a word doc. Yeah, yeah. In its original form. I just transferred it to Google Docs so I could print it out here. So Oh, okay. But if you log on to Canvas here, I could just do that. You yeah. could get it in the form that it's meant to be, right. so that you're not missing oh. half of your stuff. Because that's very confusing to read, I think. Yeah. So the kanji that. You